Readings from the Liturgical Year by Dom Prosper Guéranger Friday of Ember Week The Church does not read anything from the prophet Isaiah today. She merely gives, in the office of Matins, a sentence of that chapter of St. Luke's Gospel which relates to the mystery of Our Lady's visitation. And to this, she subjoins a fragment of St. Ambrose's homily upon that passage. The considerations and affections with which this important event of Our Lady's life ought to inspire the faithful shall be given further on in the proper of the saints. The station for today is in the Church of the Holy Apostles, which many suppose to have been first built by Constantine, and in which the glorious bodies of the two Holy Apostles Philip and James the Less, buried under the altar, await the second coming of him, who chose them as his cooperators in the work of the first, and who on the last day will give them to sit upon thrones near his own, judging the twelve tribes of Israel. That we may the better conform to the intentions of our Holy Mother the Church, who offers to our contemplation the visitation of the Blessed Virgin, let us recite the following hymn, composed in honor of this mystery during the ages of faith. Hail, Mother of the Divine Word! Hail, most humble and most spotless Virgin! Rejoice, thou Mother of a Son, who supports thee! Rejoice, thy burden is a burden most sweet to bear! Hail, branch of Jesse, fruit-bearing branch! Hail, gate of the temple, closed to all but God! Be glad, thou fleece of Gideon, full of the dew of the Holy Spirit! Be glad, thou tent of Solomon, of all the first in beauty. Hail, shining star of Jacob, lighting up the sea. Hail, thou sealed up sanctuary, thou burning bush. What bliss is thine, that thou, the humble star, shouldst be clad with the sun, and then bring forth the sun. What bliss is thine, that thou shouldst be elected the bright ladder reaching up to heaven. Sing to thy God, thou aurora, rising in the light of the new star. Sing, thou ark of the covenant, bearing unto us sinners thy three treasures. O let thy soul magnify Jesus, and O sweet Mary, pray that with thee we too may magnify him. Amen.